Hey everyone, welcome back to another Counterside video. So today's video, before we do our summons for uh, you, Mina, I'd like to have a review with her first. But before that, if you want an updated Counterside videos, please hit the subscribe button down below. Okay, so we are here. Um, I was actually just just uh, thinking a while ago. Um, should I really summon for her? But come to think of it. I am wanting to collect most of the units. I at this point, I'm not sure if I'm doing uh, this right. Um, I heard that we are going to get her free probably after a year, but that's a year. That's a year from now. So I might as well summon for her. But uh, let's take a look, take a look at her stats first. So in terms of her stats, she has um, above average HP. Excellent attack, very good, um, very, very good. Defense is actually above average as well. She has low crit, she has below average hit, and below average evasion. So that is, um, in terms of her stats, she is quite quite a bit tanky, as expected for an um, Awakened SSR and Awakened Striker. Let's, look at, uh, let's take a look at her skills. So for her basic skill, uh, basic attack is an AoE attack, valid to hits, produces Wolf's, Wolf's Bane for her gun, and swing set inflicting AoE damage in front. Basic attack damage plus 5 up to level 5, uh, sorry, level 2 up to level 5, so a total of plus 20% attack damage. Next is her passive skill, which is Wolf's Fang. Valid hits when deployed, discharges forward, uh, sorry, charges forward and inflicts AoE damage. Then additionally attacks targets in a 6 meter radius. After every third basic attack, she delivers an enhanced attack in Gauntlet, afflicts additional damage by 15% of current HP on non-ship targets within valid hits. Okay, this is actually the reason why I decided to pull for her for her for her passive skill. The deployment um, effect is actually very valuable right now. I don't re again. I don't really have Kang So Yun available at this point, so I'm willing to gamble on her um, just for this skill. This is actually very excellent in terms of uh, coming to play deployment and more or less um, dealing damage when she comes into play. So for her um, level one to level five, level two to four first attack speed max would be 20 percent but on her level 5 immunity to hit stun from special or lower skills for six seconds of after deployed passive adds attack speed plus 30 percent for six seconds which is actually crazy because again she deals a lot of attack and attack damage and she actually has increased attack speed next on is her special skill sword blaster 18 second cooldown valid is three hits charges at a target and swings her sword inflicting aoe damage on surrounding enemies then she fires a blaster upward inflicting additional aoe damage again tremendous hero or unit for damage level one three and uh, level two three and four damage of plus 25 percent level five is cooldown <laughs> minus four seconds special skill uh, attack also counts take a note uh, take uh take note of that and last is her ultimate skill wolves bane legacy 52 second cooldown valid hits is four minimizes wolves bane power and inflict and inflicts eo damage in the front okay four valid hits take note of that as well level two what two three four damage is a total of plus 25 percent then on level five passive decreases ultimate skill cooldown by three seconds so again i'm not waiting for a year i'll try to summon her now so let's see if i have luck in terms of summoning for her so let's proceed to summoning for her banner okay so no no more free pulls or free recruit for her. Let's try to... I've had so much... Uh, what do you call this? I've had so much luck in terms of single pulls, especially for Reginald uh, King. That is why I'm try I'm, I'm going to do first um, single pulls for her. Um, let's see how my luck goes. Let's do a 10 
but only recruit one time let's go i think i have enough uh um i have enough to summon for her it's it would just actually just boil down to luck so more or less for those who don't have the ceo in the picture i'm going to breeze through the summon so i'm just gonna gonna be you know uh be pulling for suspense once the ceo appears so he's not here again let's pull this down because these are just uh these are just uh, fillers in my roster. Let's move ahead. I'm actually excited to get her. Hopefully, my theory checks out that uh, single, single, you know, single pulls are more efficient. I, I find it more efficient because again, you're not wasting pulls and the rates are still the same. And more or less, this is ten, this is one, so it's just, uh, you know, it's just. Uh, um, adds up as well just going to be one at a time again the CEO nuts is not here so where is he where is he uh, still no sign no sign of the CEO maybe he's still asleep so here he is he heard me let's uh, try to pull Purple SR for oh, the, the Karate Kid. Got the Karate Kid. Let's move on. I think this is my fifth pull already. Let's see if EO is here. Not here. Let's move on to the next. This actually brings me more joy than, than the recruitment 10 times. Um. Actually, the ensure recruitment carries over, so I'll, I'll go back to that later. So, let's see what the CEO brings. Done. Still an SR. It's going to be Jake Walker, which I'm planning to level up as well for counter case. So if you can see here, um, previous banner for Awaken Hill Day, ensure recruitment definitely is being carried over so far i think i just i still i just pulled around seven or eight let's move forward so i have one two left still good skip this one hound i already have the hound at level 110 let's do this again another skippable pull Skip, skip, skip. Getting anxious already. <laughs> Getting anxious. Eos. Where's the CEO? That uh, SQ robot. I'm not sure how many pulls I did already. Probably around 10. Not sure. So here he is. Back. Let's see if he brought me somebody. Still purple SR. The Troyina. I need copies of her actually. I need her to be in uh, level 100 for counter case as well. Let's, let's just move this along. Hopefully soon. So Ari Alford, I already have at 110 so thank god could use her other copies for other things or probably just uh, delete them resources yes there he is still nothing guys I think evelyn keller i need copies of her definitely still need have her at 110 Let's just push on. I still have a thousand something uh, premium recruits. Let's just skip this. Classified employment contract. Uh, 1,070. So let's I'll proceed. Probably have one ten pull once I reach a thousand. Then go back to single pulls. 
Still nothing, guys. Not even an SSR. Or any other SSR for that matter. I'll check. <laughs> I'll check the rates after this one. See if I'm not being, uh, you know, not being duped. Rates. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have the rates. Probability 1%. You mean now. Okay. SSR 3.5. Let's just uh, move this along. I still have. Uh, I'll have a 10 pull after this one. We'll see if. Let's try one 10 pull. It's for. Luck. I think this is you mean already. See? The achievement actually the achievement actually gave her away so more or less again thank god i only i think had 20 20 pulls for this 20 plus very good i'm gonna save the rest um the banner actually gave it away <laughs> the achievement banner so no there was no thrill in that, so glad to have pulled theirs. Let's see if I get more SSRs. The first. Another SR. Another SR. Another SR. Let's skip this. These are probably ours already. Okay, so there you go, guys. So I'm happy to have gotten her after 20 pulls. I have around... 800 classified employment contracts left good for for 40 pulls more or less but i'll save it for the next um ssr banner sorry uh the next uh awakened ssr banner so more or less hopefully luck continues there i'm happy actually today that i got her on the first 10 pull at least for the first 10 pull so the other single pulls not so much but anyway guys Thank you for those who have stuck this far this video. Also, please consider subscribing while you're here. Hit the bell icon and also have a like to this video if you like this summon session. Thank you guys. Take care. Stay safe. This is The Warden and I'm out here.